Hey guys, what is up? I am going through some samples that I just received today. <laughs> yes, I just adjusted my tripod. <laughs> you guys, look at this. That was my thumbnail that I just did. You guys, look at this. Okay, we're gonna go through these colors. So this is some hair that I'm definitely thinking about adding to Petri Co. Uh, you guys can shop our current line of products at PetriEssentials.com. I'm just giving you to the sneak peek. Um, I really just wanted to, I specifically requested these colors because I'm trying to get this going ASAP and right around the time when this is going to drop, these colors would be appropriate. But look at this. This is giving me cotton candy very pretty and i like that it's pre-stretched that's important for all of my girls out there i just think it's so pretty so let me know what you guys think about that so i'm just gonna look through each color natural colors two and four one be two and four i just wanted to see what they would look like this is definitely a four it's a little browner And I'm just checking to see like if it's tangling, is it shedding when I do this? It does all of the pre-stretch look the same. Um, the scent, that's important. Nobody wants stinky braiding here. This is such a pretty color. Right, isn't it? Look at it. This is so pretty, it's like a cinnamon cinnamon stick I love it so that's that now this color looking at the bag like it is not <laughs> it's not what I expected I was going for that darker green more forest green this is a little bit more watery blue versus green you guys can see um still pretty but this is not the green that i was going for i'm definitely looking for another green this color right here i specifically chose this because obviously number one is a good ombre color but this the bread when you mix it with burgundy it's gonna be really pretty so these could be your highlights the burgundy could be your main color very pretty it's giving sangria dipped hot cheetos <laughs> no it's kidding it's, it's it's giving red hot and cherries like that is red okay i like this so i'm gonna put this in the keep pile so far i like the natural colors and i like these bright colors okay let me show y'all isn't this cute this is like cotton candy summer time like cotton candy and skydiving i could see it i could see it i could see this like blend got that peach tones in there super pretty like oh! This is the keeper. This is exactly what I want to introduce because I know I have my bold girls out there who are ready to try stuff and summer is perfect for y'all. So very pretty. It's not tangling either. Like very pretty. <laughs> Oops. I messed it up trying to take out the packet. It didn't come like this. Oh my God. This is very much orange highlighter, <laughs> but it's so pretty. It's so pretty. Like, oh, look at it. Look at it. Look, look, girl. Look at this. Look at it. Orange. Orange, you glad I picked this color? Would you just, would you just, 
it's it's actually a darker purple so it, it is one that's going to complement the skin tones of the wide spectrum of melanin i love it i love it look at that ombre got that purple in there and then it goes into the deep very much grape it's subtle, right? It's not like so, oh, she got purple hair. It's like, oh, her hair is purple. What do you guys think of this? This is giving, dang, that dog. This is, when I look at this, I think of like, I do think of Halloween, but it also is, I think of Halloween when I see this color gives me like midnight we're gonna call this midnight great i don't know <laughs> but this, this kid, the dog must like this it's giving midnight lavender midnight very pretty right so basically this is the full version of it just as pretty it's it's so pretty oh my gosh it's like i'm not just purple i'm giving you everything this is a color that um it's darker than the gray i wore my last braid style but i think it's pretty and i think it's appropriate i think it also blends well with um again brown skin that is who i'm marketing to um this is going to look good on chocolate skin like this is a pretty gray like so if you've been wanting to try gray you can try this we'll call this like bullet or something <laughs> can i call a product bullet like you probably get flagged everywhere like this is a bullet but you get the idea like this steel we'll call it steel i mean I'm really just showing y'all, but y'all let me know. I love this gray, this purple, this orange, this candy, this mix too. Those are fire. They do have that red, full purple, full brown. Oh, okay, I got two different purples. This is the purple that you guys are used to. It is ombre. You've got your black up top transitions into the purple okay so you see this purple this is the purple that we're used to seeing you see the difference this one is much bluer this one is much brighter so two different tones of purple both very beautiful and would mix beautifully when you actually install them i love it i didn't like it actually when i just seen it but <laughs> look at it Tell me this does not give you watermelon. Hey, got that green on the top, very Billie Eilish. Okay, then we got that hot pink in the middle and that baby pink on the ends. It, oh, there's a radish, there's a radish. If I can find a picture, I will put it in. But there's a radish that is exactly these colors. This is giving me like a watermelon vibe, like juicy watermelon. <laughs> I wouldn't call it that, but that is exactly what it gives. <laughs> this very much pink highlighter but it's still it's not just pink highlighter it is very much got that it's got like these pretty purple magenta tones in it so i think it's pretty so with these together like i could see this being a little look a lot of pink a lot of brightness but i can see it being a look i really like this but i like this as like a fill-in color it could blend with purple you know i'm all about giving options <laughs> i'm gonna give the people options very bold right so this is a pretty green mix pretty green ombre that again i could see the girls wearing in summer um on summer break transitions into this greenish blue color of that other ombre which i really thought it was darker so i'm gonna hold on to this because i want it deeper than this it transitions here right into a pretty green but from this neon green to this middle green to this aqua green i don't really care for this green here 
So I would try to see if they could make it an actual like forest green versus whatever this bluish green is. Okay, you see that? It's okay. I would do it only because I need an adjacent. I need a purple and a blue. But I'm gonna see if they have another type of blue as well. Got these like brown tones and red tones, earth tones. So this is like your standard. I'm feeling for any weird stuff in the hair, just making sure it's good. The colors, again, I'm just gonna pull to see if it's tangling. Very much red wine, burgundy kind of color. All right, so they all start ombre. This one is your like 27, very much honey. This is your wine burgundy, and then this is like your cinnamony type of color. So these are like your standard natural colors, you know, that I feel like my corporate girls could still rock. Give y'all up close. Yeah. Yeah, this year I'm looking to just expand and dip into things that I have just been waiting to tap into. So I'm going to give you guys a sneak peek. YouTube saw it first, so <laughs> shout out to y'all. 